I came to this store. It's not a corner store, it's like a mini market because I need to get like a snack or something because I need to go grocery shopping but I have somewhere to be in less than 45 minutes so I don't want to feel rushed. So I just walked over here to get a nice snack. Look at this. Because I'm so hungry. too hard. Yeah, maybe I'll get this apple. Maybe I'll get something else because I am so, so hungry. This store is so annoying. Well, this little market, look at how expensive this is. So annoying. $8 for wheat thins. I think they're wet beans. How much? Maybe they're not weak for the weekends. Maybe they're not. I take that back. I don't want to eat too much because I want to have a good dinner. I'm trying to wake up in the morning and go to a cycling class at. 6.30. So I want to make sure I get a good night's sleep. Okay, I do YouTube, so I'm going to put this on my YouTube. <laughs> what is that? Oh, thank you. You guys, this store, they're Muslim here. So make sure when you come here, you come to this store. He wanted me to sample a falafel. It is so good. Don't worry, I'm going to get a gel manicure, hopefully, in a few after I'm done doing what I have to do. So I finally made it to the grocery store. But I'm not even really hungry because of the pear and those sweet chili chips that I had. I knew that was going to happen. But I feel like as soon as I get home, I'm going to be starving. But I'm really trying to like hurry up and get home because I really, really want to take that 6.30 cyclone class in the morning. And I want to get a good night's sleep tonight so I'll be ready for the class early in the morning. I'm thinking if I want to get this organic maple syrup. I think I am going to get it. I like this. They have halal chicken. I knew I loved this place. So I made it from the second class. I'm so, I'm so proud of myself that I actually got up and went to the second class this morning. And the class was amazing. I can't believe this shirt turned purple. Oh. in there with those laundry pearls and the shirt turned purple but on the sleeve you can see like the bleach marks that is white I don't know how this happened and then I ran it through again with just the hot water and the laundry well in the washer and then I just put it in hot water in the sink so I don't know we'll see I <laughs> maybe it's not meant to have bleach on it um, but I guess I'll see when I get back Oh God, that's so annoying. I guess I would 
ran out of laundry detergent. But anyways, I'm going out anyways to run some errands. So I'll go get some and hopefully I can recover that shirt. But if not, I could get a new one or I could bring it to the dry cleaner as well. But I didn't, I would like to know why did it turn purple? It was a white shirt, like a pearl white shirt. I just don't understand that. So I put that shirt in the washer again. So hopefully this time around, the third time is always a charm. It'll come back to white instead of being purple. But if not, I might have to bring it to the dry cleaner. You can hear the washer as well. So I got the shirt out the dryer and it looks like the method worked. It's not purple anymore, which is a good thing. So I'll never do that again. I'm so excited, it worked. So I got this uh, navy blue, one of many, this navy blue hijab from Hodge Drawer. But tomorrow for Jumar, I wanted to wear this, but I wanted to wear it with with a gown similar to this. So I'm about to go to Hajj right now to see if I can find a gown that's navy blue for tomorrow. So hopefully I'll be able to find something. Otherwise I'll have to wear one of my other gowns that I have and wear a different hijab. Oh yeah, and I'm wearing that white shirt from the other day as well. It came out so clean. I'm so happy it came out well. Because I was so annoyed, but whatever. It always works out. I guess they'll come back. But the store is so cute. So I guess I'm going to have to come back or just wear a gown that I have in my closet. So we'll see. So I'm on my way to the masjid and I just ended up, as you can see, wearing the purple one. But this is low-key my favorite, but I have to get more, um, like more gowns besides like purple and black. So next time I'm not going to wait to the last minute and I'll go on time. And it looks like my face is breaking out. Oh God. Oh no. The trauma. Going inside. So.